We all know about the famous Microsoft framework called Autogen, and this is something that enables the development of large language model applications using multiple agents, and it can converse with each other to solve various ranges of tasks. Now, Autogen is something that can also create multiple different types of agents, which can be customizable, conversable, as well as seamlessly allowing human participation. They can operate in various nodes, and they can even employ combinations of large language models, human inputs, as well as various toolkits. Now, the great thing is we have a huge new update that not a lot of people know about. I actually, in particular, found out about this just recently today based off of another YouTuber's video. This is an Autogen Studio UI update. It's a way you can interactively explore multi-agent workflows quite easily. Now, I know this might be getting repetitive, but I really want to emphasize on our private Discord as it has been thriving a lot recently. There has been a lot of great things coming out of this as you can just see from this like image right here on the screen where we basically just had a new partnership where we are giving out paid subscription plans for Dataku. And this is an amazing a effortless and accurate approach for data extraction. Now, this is just an example of something that we do and work with. There's multiple different paid subscriptions that are given out to our Discord members for free. You simply become a member and you get access to various different AI tools across the month. And it's on different ranges of AI tools. It's not necessarily just data execution tools, but it's various different types of categories in the field of AI. Now. We don't just end up giving out free subscriptions to AI tools. We also give out various other different things like collaboration opportunities where people can basically work as a team to build applications. We have various networks. We have news outlets. We have resources as well as daily AI inputs. So definitely recommend you check out the Patreon link in the description below as I really wanted to emphasize what you guys are missing out on if you guys are not a part of this. Just take a look at this preview of Autogen Studio, which is an Autogen powered AI application. It's something that is to help rapidly prototype AI agents, enhance them with skills, and even compose them into workflows and interact with them. You can do various things with them to accomplish tasks, and it's built on top of the Autogen framework. So you have everything that you have worked with in the previous Autogen framework right over here into this UI. It's a toolkit that can be used for building AI agents way more easier as you can see over here you have the build playground and gallery which is three different tabs in which you can start deploying and working with multi ai agent workflows now in this case with this example we can see that there is a more structured ui to help us work and play around with multiple agents but in this case we gave this prompt where they plotted a chart of nvidia as well as tesla and they were just trying to find the price the stock price for the year to date and they managed to actually save the results in a file named NVIDIA and Tesla.png. And you can see that this is the file over here. It was, it was able to plot it out. And this is something that you can do easily within this new Autogen Studio. Now, this is something that is truly a game changer as it's going to make life so much more easier to manage and build multi-agent workflows. Throughout today's video, we're going to delve a little bit deeper into this new upgrade for Autogen. So with that thought, guys, stay tuned and let's get straight into the video. If you would like to book a one on one with me where you can access my consulting services, where I can help you grow your business or basically give you a lot of different types of solutions with AI, definitely take a look at the calendar link in the description below. Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, I'm going to be covering Autogen once again because they have a new studio UI update, which is fully powered by Autogen. It's designed to facilitate the rapid prototyping of multi-agents and it's a solution for various different tasks. Now, they specified a lot of different things in this blog post, which we'll cover before we go into the installation. But in this case, they have basically specified four different criteria that it allows you to do. Firstly, you have different types of ways to like customize different agents. And this is where you can define and modify these agents as well as multi-agent workflows using a point and click and drag and drop interface, which is the thing that we saw at the start of this video. This basically allows you to easily select parameters for agents and you can enable them to communicate and collaborate in solving specific tasks within this UI.
Secondly, you have the interactive chat sessions. And this is a new update that is provided with this UI. And it's going to allow you to create chat sessions with a specified agent. So you can specifically interact with them and view chat histories so that you can imagine, or not imagine, but you can examine generative files or even monitor them so that you can have better generation for future cases. The third thing that I want to talk about is the skill edition. And this is where it allows you to explicitly add skills to agents. You can now add particular skills to the agent, uh, like the previous sessions that we talked about. You can add these skills to those sessions so that you can have it so that it can enhance their capability of the agent so that they can accomplish a wider range of tasks. Lastly, you have a local gallery, which is the third tab over here. And this is where you have the option to publish your own session to a local gallery. Gallery, sorry. This is a feature that will basically enable sharing or collaboration. And you can basically have it so that other users can access and review the defined agents, workflows, as well as outcomes that you have created. So let's get into the next step where we actually showcase how you can install this. Now, what you will need beforehand is that you'll need to make sure that you have your LM provider. In this case, if you're using an open AI API key, make sure that it's linked to a billing account. And once you have the API key ready, you need to make sure that you have Conda. This is to create our virtual environment. You'll need Python as well as Visual Studio Code in case we need to edit certain types of APIs. So once you have all these different things ready, applications ready, we can move forward with installation. So what you want to do first is make sure that you create your virtual environment using Conda. So this is basically to make sure that you don't have any sort of conflicts with prior Python libraries. So open up command prompt, copy and paste this over here. Uh, you want to basically create conda create hyphen n auto gen studio one python equals 3.11 so once you create that virtual environment it'll take a couple seconds and once this is finished we can then activate it so while it is then creating this virtual environment it'll then ask you if you want to proceed forward you then just simply need to press y and click enter then you'll get to this point where you need to activate your auto gen studio so you can just type in conda Activate Autogen Studio 1 and click enter. This will activate your environment and then we can move forward with setting the API key as well as installing the requirements. Now, in the case that you want to use your own LM provider, they have a documentation as to how you can set this up. So definitely recommend you check this out so that you can use any sort of provider that you want. But in this case, I'm just going to simply use OpenAI. So what you can do is go back to your command prompt and type in set open AI underscore API underscore key equals your API key. Now the set command is for Windows. So keep that in mind if you're using Linux or Mac OS, you need to use the export command to do this. So you simply just click enter and it will then set the API key for this. Now, what you want to do next is fairly simple. You just copy this over here, pip install Autogen Studio, and then go back onto your command prompt and paste it and click enter. This will now start installing the dependencies that are needed for this UI. So it'll take a couple of minutes. So once it's done, I'll be right back. Now, they also have an installation for source. So if you want to install from source, you can follow the commands over here. But once you have basically installed the dependencies, you can then go down to the running the application. You simply just copy this and then paste it into your command prop and you will then have it locally hosted on your computer. It's easy as that. This will start this up on our local server. We can just have it running on this link over here. So I'm going to copy this and then go onto the user interface so we can start playing around with it. So what you want to do next is go to this link over here, which is the local host, and you can simply just have it opened up over here and you can start playing around with Autogen on this new UI. It's super easy. As you talked about the start, you can build, go to the playground and have this gallery. Now on the build, you can see that there is different workflows already in which you can start creating and focusing on various different types of agent workflows. You can have multiple agent workflows as well as singular agent workflows. You can set different skills in which it can fetch different types of things or skills to a particular type of agent. You can create multiple agents and you're also able to play around with them over here where you can start chatting and having execute various tasks. And that's basically for this Autogen Studio UI. If you want me to create another video on this where I can create potential like agents with this, I can definitely make another video on that. 
But that's basically it for today's video on Autogen Studio. I hope you enjoyed this video and you got some sort of value out of it. I'll leave all the links in the description below so that you can access it fairly easily. Uh, make sure you check this out because I truly believe that this is a great tool for you to use to help create different types of multi-agent applications. So with that thought, guys, make sure you check out the Patreon page if you want to access our private Discord where you can get various different descriptions for free. Make sure you follow us on Twitter so you can stay up to date with the latest AI trends and live lastly make sure you guys subscribe turn on the notification bell like this video and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest ai news but with that thought guys thank you guys so much for watching have an amazing day spread positivity and i'll see you guys fairly shortly peace out fellas